All right, so the, the excessive detail uh, serves two purposes. One is it kind of punctures what is, what is a very imminent, with an A, uh, depictions of the American criminal justice system on television shows, movies, as you mentioned, uh, certain kinds of novels that are really superficial dealings with, with what is a, a, a huge body of human activity. So the, the detail that you're referring to kind of punctures that a bit and saying, oh, so you're interested in the legal system. Let's see if you really are interested in the legal system. I'm going to bore you with the minutia of what it really is. So yeah, I did kind of uh, get a kind of subversive thrill out of saying, subverting these notions of the criminal justice system somehow being converted into mere entertainment. Now, the second purpose that it served, as I say, is that by focusing, for example, there's only one trial depicted in the novel, by focusing on what appears to be incredibly minor uh, um, crime, let's call it, you are highlighting the fact that you know, the definition of crime, what the average layperson thinks of when they think of crime, in many ways is, mis is misapplied, is, is, an, is a mistake, <laughs> in the sense that um, um, Americans are taught to think of crime as a person violently assaulting an innocent person, and therefore they must be incarcerated in order to keep society safe. And certainly that kind of crime exists. Obviously, I don't deny that. And obviously what should happen to somebody who acts violently towards their fellow citizens is an important concern. What um, The point I'm trying to make by depicting what is a minor economic crime is that the overwhelming um, percentage of what gets labeled crime in the United States is not that. What, the, the overwhelming number of people filling prisons and jails in the United States have not committed any violence whatsoever. Um, they have essentially committed either purely uh, minor economic crimes, as you're referring to, or they've somehow been caught up in what, what we earlier referenced as this war on drugs, essentially engaging in behavior that, har if it harms anyone, harms themselves principally and mainly. So uh, the, the excessive detail, the, the focusing on these minor things, I think A, gives you a more accurate picture of what's really going on, and B, yeah, it does subversively, as you say, uh, puncture a hole, God willing, in this mass entertainment bull that's been perpetuated for decades at this point.